Hey everyone, my name is Tom J. McCoy and I'm a director and editor from Arizona. In this video, I'm gonna be talking about what resampling is and why you should normally disable it when editing in Vegas Pro. So I'm just gonna start off by saying why I'm making this video. I've been asked this question a lot, mostly in a lot of my older tutorials, and I wanna have an adequate reference to show people when I'm answering their questions. So this video will be for past videos and future videos to talk about why you should disable resample. So let's start off with what is resampling? Resampling is basically Vegas's way of working with multiple frame rates in a single timeline. So if I go to my settings here, I have a 60 FPS timeline and you can see the resample mode is set to resample and that's the default. So I'll click okay on that. And this footage here is actually 24 FPS. So if I go to the properties, uh, media, you can see right here, it's 24 FPS. So what it's doing is basically converting this 24 FPS footage into 60 FPS. So it's actually adding frames. If I scrub through these frames here, you can see it's adding some ghosting effects and it's basically adding frames in to make it 60 FPS. So that's what resampling does, is it's, it's trying to convert that. So normally you wanna disable that. So a couple of ways to disable it. Uh, one way is clip by clip. So you can right click on this clip here, go to your switches and do disable resample. And you saw it change right there. As I scrub through, now it's actually 24 FPS. There's no added frames in there. The other way to do it, if I switch this back, use project resample mode. You can go up to the settings wheel here, go to your resample mode and just click on disable resample, click apply. You saw it change there and you can start all of your new projects with these settings as well. That's what I do. And you can also double over and still click on each individual clip, go to your switches and disable resample just to be safe in case you're a little bit worried. So that's the easiest way to disable resample. I'm not sure why after all these years, Vegas still defaults to having smart resample enabled. Um, I wish that was something that, that they would fix, but you do have the option to start all of your projects with disable resample enabled. So hopefully that answers some questions for you guys. Please leave me your thoughts and comments below and be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more future tutorials if you like this one. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.